Fair Data Principles are guidelines to enhance the reusability of scientific data. We will show you how you can assess the fairness of a data set and which tools you can use to make research data findable, accessible, interoperable and reusable for people and machines. This is brought to you by experts of CESDA, the Consortium for European Social Science Data Archives. To reuse data, you need to be able to find them. This means that they are indexed and discoverable via search engines and catalogues and have machine readable metadata. Unique identifiers such as a digital object identifier and detailed metadata that enable discovery and provide detail about the content to the user facilitate this. Data being accessible means that they can be retrieved via the identifier through an open protocol. This may require authentication and authorization. Interoperable data have a standard open and machine readable file format and the data elements are tagged with standard vocabularies or ontologies. All these aspects make data reusable. A license should describe how the data can be used and whether conditions apply. Remember that fair data is not the same as open data. Provenance information also helps for reuse. Let's now see what this means in practice. Various tools exist to assess the fairness of your data. One such tool is the Fair Self-Assessment Tool, developed by the Australian Research Data Commons. Twelve questions guide you in assessing how fair your data are and determine how to enhance the fairness. We will assess the so-called mould dataset, resulting from monitoring of young people's lifestyle and everyday life. Data on physical activity, diet, well-being, etc. are collected from 16 to 20 year olds in Denmark and the dataset is held in the Danish National Archives. The MOLD dataset is made findable thanks to its unique, citable and persistent DOI. The dataset identifier is also included in the codebook. The data are described with rich and detailed metadata, including a codebook and machine-readable DDI metadata. The data are discoverable via the Danish National Archives and more widely, thanks to Metadata Exchange, also via the CESDA Data Catalog, Google Dataset Search and Datasite. The data are freely accessible and made available for download after completing an order form and agreeing with the use conditions. The data are available in various file formats, including as comma-separated values, a machine-readable standard open format. The data elements are described using DDI metadata. The dataset is licensed under a standard text-based license. Detailed provenance is provided in the codebook, explaining the variables, survey design, the questions asked during the survey, and the frequency distribution of the responses. Scoring bars show how fair the dataset is according to those 12 criteria. We could make this dataset more fair by making the data more easily accessible online. This does not mean providing open access. That would be impossible for this dataset containing personal and sensitive data. Safeguards will always need to be put in place. Having the dataset order form available in English would also help. Interoperability can be improved by linked up metadata that link to the entire series and the datasets of the same study carried out in other years as the survey has been repeated regularly. Making the license and the use conditions visible in the metadata also raises fairness. Here are some tools and strategies you can use to make your research data fair. Publish your data in a trustworthy data repository. 
Such repositories will take care of many requirements for FAIR data for you. For example, developing detailed machine-readable and interoperable metadata, persistent identifiers and standard file formats. You can find a suitable repository via RE3Data or the CESDA network. CESDA's Data Management Expert Guide provides a lot of useful and easy to understand guidance for researchers to make their data fair. Writing a data management plan using the DMP online tool is always a good starting point. And make sure to check the GoFair starter kit. This video is produced by the Consortium of European Social Science Data Archives. For more information on CESDA, please visit www.cesda.eu.